Once upon a time in a small village nestled in the heart of a lush green valley, there lived a young boy named Leo. Leo was curious and adventurous, with a heart full of wonder and a mind full of questions. Leo lived with his parents in a small cottage at the edge of the village. They were simple folk, but they were happy, for they had each other and the beauty of the world around them. One night, as Leo was lying in bed, he looked out the window and saw the most beautiful sight he had ever seen. The sky was filled with stars, twinkling and shining like diamonds. Leo was filled with wonder. He had so many questions about the stars. What were they made of? How far away were they? Were there other worlds out there just waiting to be discovered? Leo knew that he had to find out more. So, he decided to go on an adventure to learn all about the stars. The next day, Leo set out into the village to find someone who could teach him about the stars. He went from house to house asking everyone he met if they knew anything about the stars, but no one could help him. They all told him that the stars were just pretty lights in the sky and that there was nothing more to know. Leo was disappointed, but he didn't give up. He knew that there had to be someone out there who could teach him about the stars. Finally, after many days of searching, Leo came across an old man sitting by the side of the road. The old man was gazing up at the sky, lost in thought. Excuse me, said Leo politely. Do you know anything about the stars? The old man looked down at Leo and smiled. Ah, yes, he said. The stars are my greatest passion. I have studied them for many years. Leo was overjoyed. He had finally found someone who could teach him about the stars. The old man took Leo under his wing and taught him everything he knew about the stars. He showed Leo how to find the different constellations and how to tell the time by looking at the position of the stars in the sky. Leo learned that the stars were made of gas and dust and that they were incredibly far away. He learned that some stars were bigger than others and that some were brighter than others. The old man also told Leo about other worlds out there in the universe, just waiting to be discovered. He told Leo about planets orbiting around other stars and about galaxies far beyond our own. Leo was amazed by everything he learned. His mind was filled with wonder and his heart was filled with joy. Every night Leo would lie in bed and look up at the stars, dreaming of all the amazing things he had learned. And every day he would go out into the world with a sense of awe and wonder, knowing that there was so much more out there just waiting to be discovered. And so, Leo lived a long and happy life, always learning and always exploring, and he never forgot the old man who had taught him about the stars and opened his eyes to the wonders of the universe. The End I hope you enjoyed this bedtime story.